What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name is Michael Roman, AKA All Fires. Now, I think there were a lot of us who were mildly shocked to see John Krasinski show up as Mr. Fantastic during the Illuminati scenes in Multiverse of Madness, and there were a myriad of reasons for that, but for me, it was mostly because we were getting him as a variant of Reed Richards, and before we got the actual 616 or main Fantastic Four in our continuity, but I think there were a lot of reasons in retrospect that it specifically had to be Mr. Fantastic, because the dialogue that took place and during that part of the film mostly coming from Reed Richards was some of the most important dialogue we've gotten so far in phase four and phase five especially for setting up incursions and their role in the multiverse saga that you needed it coming from a source like Reed Richards so that we could all buy in and trust that what he was saying was well right but what's really crazy about that scene in the involvement of Mr. Fantastic is that the biggest reveals aren't even multiverse distinctions like 616 and 838 or what he revealed about incursions. The biggest reveal came from Reed Richards when he admitted to Wanda that he had a family that included children, because as we all know, and if you're a fan of the comics, one of them is Franklin Richards, one of the most powerful beings that has ever existed and has a huge role to play in major crossover events, especially when it comes to the multiverse and another huge character in Galactus. Well, today we have a major bombshell update about the upcoming Fantastic Four film, and it looks like there was a reason why Marvel Studios ultimately included that line of dialogue as it applies to the upcoming film. We're going to break down the latest what's going on with the production timeline and the reveal that Franklin Richards will be a part of the Fantastic Four film coming up. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we do daily Marvel content at the channel, and that's all we do. Everything from official Easter egg breakdowns, trailers and reviews to the occasional industry insider report and everything in between. So if that sort of thing's for you, hit the sub button, leave a comment down below that will automatically enter you to win our ongoing PS5 giveaway. And in fact, we're going to announce a brand new winner at the end of this video for the celebration of X-Men 97 dropping. So amazing. We'll also give away another one in just about a month when the season finale goes live in April. So if you want to be entered to win for that one, just hit the sub, leave a comment down below, stick around at the end of the video, we'll announce a brand new PS5 winner there. Okay, so this was the latest breaking today and coming from the industry insider and Twitter scoopster, Can We Get Some Toast, who has a proven track record over the last couple of years, like the one he recently dropped when we got a first look at the leader from Captain America Brave New World. What he's saying about the Fantastic Four is first up for the production timeline, that it won't actually start filming till August, but that's something that we expected considering they're doing some slight rewrites to the script. We'll talk about that a little later in this video. The second huge bombshell reveal was that Franklin Richards will indeed be in the Fantastic Four film. Now again, and as I mentioned during the prologue, there's a specific reason they decided to have Reed Richards say that he still has a family and kids other than for Wanda to make some cold hearted statement about them still having a mother to look after them after she kills Reed Richards. It was to imply that across the multiverse, Franklin Richards is out there somewhere and it appears as though now we'll have our own version in the 616. Now, there are a ton of storylines as it pertains to Franklin Richards and Galactus, and not to completely spill the beans, but in one storyline, he actually raises Galactus as his herald, and in another storyline, an Earth-X storyline that I think they might actually be using, we'll talk about that in a much deeper theory video, he actually becomes Galactus himself. Now that Earth X storyline is absolutely nuts and one I would love to see interpolated into the Avengers Secret War storyline. There's a reason I think it might, again we'll talk about that in a separate video, but we have heard and more than likely that Galactus is going to be the villain in during this Fantastic Four film. But don't expect any of this Franklin Richards Galactus stuff to happen and right away because it will not be adult Franklin Richards, rather it'll be the children Franklin and Valeria, the same two children that Mr. Fantastic from 838 referenced, and believe it or not, this is not actually the first time that we've heard it. It's only the first time we've heard it from an industry insider in real recently. Almost a year and a half ago when the first drafts of the Fantastic Four were starting to be talked about, there was an anonymous 4chan leak that said the first movie would involve their children. Now, here we are all this time later hearing it from an industry insider source. Now, I will mention, even though he's going to be a child, Franklin Richards is an Omega level reality warper and one of the most powerful characters that's ever existed. And because of just how OP he is, I think they're going to be very careful leaning on this character and too early. But what I will say is that some of the groundwork that makes sense for him in a storyline capacity has already been laid. And it's not just talking about the reference during 838 and coming from that Reed Richards. Rather, his nanny, a huge part of his early story, is actually Agatha Harkness, who's about to have her very own solo series and on Disney+. Plus. Now, we've asked ourselves, why in the world 
Even as good as Katherine Hahn was on WandaVision, would Agatha Harkness get her own series, maybe other than to bring back Scarlet Witch from wherever she is now, if not truly dead? But with the introduction of Franklin Richards and during the first Fantastic Four film, there would actually be a natural pairing here for those two characters. Like I said, the groundwork seems to have been laid. I will also mention that Franklin's birth involves the Fantastic Four having to travel to the negative zone, which might explain where they've been. So all of these things coming together actually make a lot of sense for him to be a part of the film, but I don't suspect he will be a main part or that we'll see too much of his reality warping or multiverse shenanigans in too early, only because if they lean on that and show just how OP he is, then it sort of makes it, well, forget power creep. Power creep's out the window. This is just absolutely maxed out level. And maybe they're gonna need a power like that to end up winning the multiverse saga. But again, you don't wanna show that in all up front because we got a long time between then and now but you guys let me know all your thoughts down below and this video as i mentioned twice during it is definitely going to spawn many more and much further in-depth storylines that this could open the door for both them in the negative zone the galactus stuff etc we'll cover that all at the channel let me know your thoughts down below quickly let's give away another ps5 Okay, so the newest winner for our ongoing PS5 giveaway is Jimothy Cricket for this comment here. The real question is, what year will X-Men 97 be set in? Even though this comment is trolling because the answer is right in the title. Either way, man, thank you so much for your support at the channel and congratulations. Either DM me on Instagram at IamFires or email me on my business email. It's under the about section on my channel. I'll get your account verified and get it right out to you guys. And if the winner wasn't you guys, don't be bummed. We have another PS5 giveaway next month when the finale goes live for X-Men 97. So if you want to be entered to win or for any of the other future giveaways here at the channel, all the same rules will always apply. Hit the subscribe button because you need to be a subscriber, then leave a comment down below because it's truly random the more videos you comment on the better chance you have of winning all winners will always be announced under the exact same format that we just used in this video showing the comment that won on screen we verify that account so if you should ever receive a spam comment either on my channel or others even though they've left us alone here for a while they have targeted some of my friends channels in the past where they grab a content creator's photo get in the comments and then tell you to hit them up on telegram or whatsapp that is just a scam they're trying to get you to pay for shipping for a prize you haven't won one, and that's why YouTubers announce winners live with their voice in the video. So please guys be safe, be vigilant. If you get a comment like that, either on this channel or any other, especially since we're doing a lot more giveaways throughout this year, please, please just report it straight to YouTube. You can let the content creator know, but guys, I assure you, if they're getting those spam comments, they already know, and they're doing everything they can to combat them. So you really help everybody, the content creator, the community, even YouTube out, by going ahead and reporting it to the proper platform. YouTube is really fast about deleting those accounts and then you're not only helping that one comment get deleted but everywhere they've commented will get removed as well think about the service you're doing so please be safe and vigilant my name's michael roman you can find me in a couple of places instagram and twitter at i'm fires you can also find me on spotify youtube amazon apple itunes wherever you listen to original music under the name all fires and while i sincerely appreciate you checking my music out thanks for checking this channel out stick around we'll be posted again real real soon